we are at Goodwill today and we are going to go in here and see what we can find for fall or Christmas or just any home decor for the house today. All right, what is this guy right here? $99. Oh boy, there was a crash and it was not me. Thank goodness. <laughs> Poor person, I feel so bad for them. Who's heavy? I can't tell. Oh, those are kind of all hooked together. All right. What is this? Give us a stare, daily bread. There's like some little brass containers made in India on the bottom. $3.99. This would be nice to kind of use for um, the bottom of a vignette. There's another one that's a little bit bigger. It is $4.99. But yeah, those would make like a really cute bottom for a vignette to put things in. If you like to use brass. And these here look like something that you might be able to use for Christmas. $3.99. They're like some plaid placemats and there are four of them so those are kind of cute oh and up here we have a matchbox holder really does not want to focus on that it says matches looks like somebody may have painted it through I'm not sure it is $2.99 these are Falls Graph here, but I've already picked some of these up, so I don't really need any more. 99 cents. I just have them in my basket on my table. So just having a couple of those is plenty. 99 cents. Any Christmas mugs? A Santa mug would be awesome. Oh, Christmas on the General Jackson. Nashville, Tennessee. 99 cents. Kind of cute. Looks like there is a pair of them there, and then they've got these snowmen. Bay Island made in China, 99 cents. Looks like they have a couple of those there too, but I don't really see. That's a cute looking little mug. Any um, Santa mugs in this row? Head and wheel around here and see what we can find a lot of times if you don't get to this goodwill early it gets hit oh these are different look at these little geese right here oh I wonder if that's from the same thing as that down there because it says VC on the bottom as well $2.99 do you guys see that there it says VC I bet you these were all Donated together. There's this one, and then there's that one back there. A couple of others. Hmm. Never seen those before. That's pretty. What do we have here. It looks kind of newer to me, though. It's not very heavy. Ironstone by. What does that say on the bottom down there? It's $4.99. Ironstone by Karenberg. I can't tell. USA. It's hard to read it and have the camera up at the same time. I'm really looking for things for fall and Christmas at this point. But, of course, if I found a really awesome piece for the house, I would pick it up. I think this is pretty. $4.99. That is big and heavy. Be very pretty on a table some fruit oh, little snowman guy I'm not seeing a whole lot on this side but we'll turn around here in a second and we'll head to the other side over here are you guys starting to think about your fall decorating right now I promised you I would reveal my fall decorating theme in this video so make sure you stay tuned because I am going to reveal that to you so these ones have a cow on them but these ones just caught my attention, of course. And they say bonjour. Let's see what they say. Oh, don't know what it says on the bottom. They are 99 cents. Nice big heavy bowl. 
There are four of them, but they do have some wear on the top. And then that one has a spot, but this is pretty. That is a pretty blue, it looks like Falls Graph. Yep, 99 cents. These look like they go with my heritage pattern. 99 cents. And I don't have any bowls. So I might pick a couple of those up because I don't have any bowls. I have a couple of plates, I have some cups, but I don't have any bowls in my collection. Does that look a little darker or does it just need cleaned? Let's see, it does say. Oh, I'm having the hardest time with these stickers today. Yes, yeah, it says Falls Graph on the bottom. Oh, that is cute. What do we have here? Look at that guy. What does that say? Hand decorated in a USA cordon blue, 99 cents. Huh. There's that guy. And then there's this one. So maybe like a set of four different roosters. So those are pretty cool too. Oh, really hoping for fall and Christmas though. Wow, they are really low on baskets today. <laughs> There must have been a basket surge. <sighs> They're very low on baskets. That one's kind of shaped like a heart. This one round one for $2.99, black. Yeah, they are very, very low in the basket department today. This one is kind of cool, but it looks like it's got a lot of damage on it. $5.99, that's a pretty cool one, but it does have all that damage. Let's check this end cap right here real quick see if we see anything interesting. I don't think anything's really jumping out. Hmm. It's under there. Those are pretty. Okay, we're gonna head down the other aisle here now and see if there's anything over here. $2.99. Oh, I didn't realize that was gonna fall over. $2.99. I would really like to find some more apples, pumpkins. What is that down there? Is that like a primitive looking paper towel holder? I think that's what that is. We're going to go ahead right now and do our commenter shout out for this video. And it goes to Dakota Peel. Missy, watching your new video from when watching you with your Ray Dunn videos with your son and husband buying things for you is just amazing. The decision to switch and do something totally different takes a lot of guts. I really enjoy your new adventure. I love the Dunn hunts as well. I just for the first time went to a Goodwill because you look like you have so much fun. I left the next day, went back to try again and got two big vases. I spray painted one and was so proud of myself. I will try again again another time. Thank you. Thank you, Dakota. And I am so happy that you have stuck around and that you had fun at Goodwill. Wow. $14.99. What is that? That is heavy. It looks like something really neat. Is that corn? What is that? Let's see. Does it say anything on the bottom? No? Let me turn it around. What is this right here? Well, that looks like corn to me, but I could be wrong. It must be something. I don't resell. I only buy things for my home when I'm out shopping. So it must be something though. $14.99. $2.99 for some of these old hangers. I've got some old hangers though in my laundry room. $2.99. Hmm. Got a lot of color. This little recipe box here is cute. It says recipe on the top. And then the chicken on the front. It lifts off. No cards in there. Oh, $14.99, the Amish Country Peddler. And then it was seven. And now it is $2.99. <laughs> That is nice though, and I do want to get a lot of my recipes on paper. I don't want them just on my phone. And it would be nice to take the really popular ones that we use all, the t all of the time out of our books and put them into one recipe box. 
All right, maybe we'll get into a little bit of Christmas stuff, but this place really looks like it's been hit hard recently. <laughs> well, this guy is kind of neat. I don't have fingernails, but it's glass. And it is a bottle on the top. Let's see. He is $2.99. You can see using him for something, especially since he's glass and with the bottle. Candles, $2.99, so a pair of those there. Here's some old, let's check this out because this right here just says vintage to me and reminds me so much of my grandmother's house growing up for Christmas. These little bells right here. I wonder if that is attached down in there. I don't want to, no, that says USA on the bottom, $3.99. I wonder if somebody took this vintage box or planter right here and then put this in there. What is this here? Christmas tablecloth, $2.99. Ooh, made in Hong Kong. And it's in the package. I wonder how big it is, 54 by 72. Then of course I will show you what I decide to get. And if I have anything that I'm styling, I will do that for you as well. Some more vintage candles, looks like. Oh, no, those ones light up, $2.99. That fooled me a little bit. Good job. A few fall things. There's a pumpkin right here. I would love to find vintage pumpkins these right here. Now those I might be able to use. $2.99 still. Wow. $2.99 on that one. And how much on this one? $2.99. So that would be $9 for those and I'm just, I think that's too much. To be honest, let me know down in the comments. Do you think $2.99 a piece is too much for those pumpkins? Let me know down in the comments because I'm going to leave them. I see these clocks right here a good bit. I always think about getting one and then I never do. This one is $2.99. Probably someday I will end up getting one. I'm thinking it would go better with what we're doing in our bedroom for decor, so that might be when I eventually pick one up. I have some of these glass sleighs. $2.99. Looks like they have a couple of them. There's two there, and then there's a smaller one here. This little guy is cute. Isn't he cute, the little pumpkin? I'm thinking he might go good with my little farm setup I have at home with my little people. I wonder if he's too big, though. Because they're probably only that big. That is really pretty. There's little bows. But again, I don't really do the blues. That is really pretty for $2.99. They just rolled out this little cart right here and it has this basket right here. And it is $3.99. And I'm feeling like this is one I might be able to do something with. So I'm going to get these out of here. And check this out. Pick this up. I'm feeling like that would be a lot more than $3.99 somewhere else. I think I might bring this one home with me. It obviously has had some repairs and is very old, but I like that about it. You can even see here where it's been rebolted. But somebody obviously loved and used this basket. So. If I don't keep the other things I have, I will definitely be getting that basket right there. Up here on top of the hutch is where I have the basket that I picked up today. Now it probably won't stay here because I have baskets up there as well, but that is where I have put it for now until I'm ready to decorate in here for fall. And then you have not seen this yet. I actually thrifted this garden encyclopedia. I did not record 
uh, that video and so um, you probably didn't see that but I have that kind of sitting up there right now with a candle that's in another video the grab bags here are $3.99 a piece and sometimes you can find some pretty cool stuff in here is that and they got like mixer things there a bunch of different napkins some fun facts for uh, baseball my son would like that he's a fax machine stats like that in his head $3.99 these guys here are really cool this looks like turkey napkin holders don't see anything on the bottom of that though they do have chips on them in several places, which I would expect, but they are still really neat. You just don't see a lot of things a lot of times that are just for Thanksgiving, like the turkeys and everything. Some toys down here. A lot of times you can find neat little craft supplies in here if you're somebody who likes to craft and do a lot of DIY. Oh, <laughs> look at the little kitty cat. Oddly enough, this picture right here is going to be a great segue into revealing my theme to you for my home for fall. It's not exactly it, but it is super close. So let me see if I can get this out where everybody can see it. And you can kind of see everything going on here in this picture. We've got the apples up here and the cookbooks. And of course the chicken cannot not have that. And then all of the cooking and baking, the corn. And then down here it says farmer's market. Now my theme is not farmer's market, but my theme for my home this year for fall is going to be a harvest market. And I cannot wait to start those decorating videos the beginning of August. All right, guys, we have 50% off blue dots, 25% off green, and 25% off furniture. Now, we are at the City Mission Thrift. I've been here one other time with you, maybe twice, and I'm not sure if you're going to see this as part of my Goodwill video or a separate video, so we'll just kind of have to see how that all goes. But again, we are looking for fall and Christmas. Whoop, Missy, it helps if you open the right door. Let's go see what we can find seems to be busy 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 and honestly I'm trying to make as many stops as I can in one trip because we all know gas prices are crazy all right let's see what we got here now these are cute hot chocolate William Sonoma there's a couple of those there 10 plates of Pyrex, $12.99. I honestly didn't know they had plates like this from Pyrex, but I guess they do. All right, not seeing much here. This little guy's cute, but he looks newer. Corel Corning, 12 piece, $3.99. I saw the sides of these plates here all stacked up like this, and I was like, oh, Jadeite. But alas, it is not jadeite. It is Corel <laughs> with the color of jadeite around it. And here looks like another one of those sets for $3.99. I wonder if I can get this one turned over and see if it says anything. That seems like a more vintage piece to me with these on it right here, like something from the 70s or something like that. I am looking for fake apples and pumpkins for my fall decor. And so I'm walking over here to see if these are actually for sale or if they are just for decoration. Because a lot of times I run into them just being for decoration and I'm not seeing any prices on these. So I'm figuring it is probably the same thing, however, these plates that they have sitting out here, if you like blues, are very, very pretty. Arc France. They are really pretty. So those don't look like they're for sale. I don't see a price on any of those. So I am going to walk back, sadly, to my little cart 
<laughs> maybe I can find some that they're selling. This antique hutch right here is adorable. Absolutely adorable. I don't know if I can get this in my car or where I would put it, but it is so cute. It is, they got it on 710 antique hutch and it is $69.99 and then of course all of their furniture is 25% off. Now the biggest problem with it that I can see of course is that this is broken and I don't really know how that could be fixed and it looks like it has the same issue kind of down here underneath on this side but man is that a super cute hutch it's like the perfect little size because we do not have a large home <laughs> and so this would fit in perfectly i don't know and i if casey rebuilt me a drawer obviously he'd have to do two and kind of try to blend them in as best he could with the piece i know he could do it but i don't know I might have to send him a picture, see what he thinks, because it's only $69.99 and it is 25% off. I am going to try to record this from over here because I'm getting a lot of light glare off the window. As you can see right there, I'll let it kind of come back here for a second. This is where I have put my little antique hutch. It is darling. Now, of course, we have not fixed anything on it yet, but this is where I have decided to go ahead and put it. It's nestled right here between my stand and then I have my fireplace here and then our couch is right there. The blanket's a mess because of Lukey. Just disregard that. That is real life. But this is where I have put it and I cannot wait to get it all, oh, sorry, decorated. I have something super fun to share with you today. I am going to be sharing a bonus video this week. I went to a new thrift store and you are going to love where all of the benefits and all the proceeds go at this thrift store. I'm really excited to share it with you. I found this amazing chicken right here, there, and some other things so you don't want to miss it. And then starting August 1st are my fall decorating videos. I hope that you are all well. Take care, friends, and thank you.